is the MC Reggie Fresh Morning Show. A station that pays. This is MC Reggie Fresh from the MC Reggie Fresh Morning Show. And folks, guess who's in the building? She was born in Hackensack, New Jersey. She graduated from West Milford High School. She went to Murray's College. She's a single mother. She's an actor, a model, an inspirational speaker. She inspires young men and women all over the world to be more than what they are. She's the author of the book, I Married the Devil. And she's a business owner, an inspiration to us all. She believes that anything is possible as long as you put your all into it. Ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, let's welcome, let's welcome Miss Native Diva. Easy, babe, I never made love, no, I never did, put it from the heart to see, got me a bad girl, I put it to you, I can't promise that, I'll be good to you, cause I had to choose, I won't admit, no, not having it, but at least I can't admit that I'll be bad. Welcome, 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 Miss Diva. Miss Native Diva on the MC Reggie Fresh Morning Show. How you doing? I'm doing great. Absolutely wonderful. So today we're going to talk about your career. We're going to talk about your business and we're definitely going to talk about your book. All righty. Okay. So the first thing I want to ask you, how long you been an entrepreneur? All my life. All your life. As far as I can remember. As far as you can yes, remember. As far as I can remember. What made you want to become an entrepreneur? Because I'm hard headed. I can't work for nobody. <laughs> hey, you like me. You already know. So, exactly. So, being a model, how long was you a model? I started when I was about 11 and um, just went out from there. When I was a teenager, you know, people just liked the way I look. I had that diff being, you know, Native American had that different look. And there it was. Have you been in any magazines or yes, news so, yes. clippings? <laughs> well, you guys got to look. I'm actually doing some work right now. I am doing jewelry. So um, you'll see a lot of that coming up this week as well. All right, cool. All right, now let's talk about your, your um, traveling business. Mm -hmm. How long you been a travel agent? For about 15 years now. Oh, wow. Get out of here. So, you yep. know, you, you I see you travel. Yes, definitely. Got to. Okay. And, you know, I have that cruise coming up, the grown and sexy cruise. You guys have to come out. All right, then the grown and sexy cruise. Where's it going to? It's going to Cozumel, Mexico, and Yogatan, Mexico. So, it's leaving from Galveston, Texas. It's five, five nights. May 6th, everybody got to come out and enjoy. We're going to have a special celebrity guest. I'm not going to mention it right now, but it's going to be worth it. All right. Okay, then, folks. Did y'all hear that? Okay. All right, now let's talk about that great book of yours. Could you please yeah. tell me the name of it? Tell me when it's going to be yeah. out and how can people purchase it when it yeah, do come out? They actually, it's going to be out the end of this month, actually. Um, it's I'm... I Married the Devil, A Native Girl Story. It's actually a true story. Um, a lot of people don't know, but a lot of people know me know that um, I'm a survivor, domestic violence survivor. So yeah. I do talks about that. I'm a speaker about that. If people could hire me, I come out and speak. But um, it's something that I think everybody should read. It's probably going to end up being a mini series when you find out the things that I actually survived. And God is good because I'm talking to you right now. I'm here. 
outstanding. That is a blessing. Wow. So anybody out there who, who, who all has been involved in domestic violence, this book coming out will be definitely an excellent buy to get. Yes, it is. Okay, now, I know that you are also a motivational speaker. Yes. I am ordained. Uh, people don't know that. They look at me and they judge <laughs> <laughs> what type of person you are. Um, but yes, believe it or not, I am ordained and I'm very spiritual. And uh, as well, you know, when you read the book, you'll see God got me through a lot. And I always have to talk to people to let them know that they can go further than they think they can. Definitely. Wow. Okay, now I need to know your contact, your your email addresses, Facebook, or whatever you got to show to give to people so they can get in touch with you to deal with all your business revenues. Oh, definitely. On um, Facebook, y'all go to at Native Diva 23, and you'll reach me there. Um, you can go to my website, check out some stuff. You can actually hire me on that, too, if you need anything. It's uh, nativediva.online. You guys can reach me out. Also, if you guys need to contact me via email, it's thenativediva at gmail.com. All right. Now, I want to ask you this. There's a lot of entrepreneurs that up and coming and want to start their own business and don't want to work for nobody like we do and want to work for themselves. Could you give me some kind of advice or give, I mean, give them some advice out there in, in your own words? Yes. One thing I'm always saying to people is if you could, you can dream it, you can achieve it. So let me tell you, anything you want to do, just put in the work, put in effort, you can do it. I mean, if it's something you really want, you got to reach out and grab it because opportunity is not going to be at your door. you got to go looking for it sometimes. So you know? basically, what you, basically what you're saying is, why look at TV when you can be TV? Exactly. All right, okay. Now, as far as the modeling career, it's a lot of ladies out here that's in the modeling world and want to be. How can they be successful in that? Well, don't be duped. <laughs> That's the first thing I'm going to tell you because um, I've been modeling for many years and a lot of these women I see, they go out here, they do these pictures, they get paid for all these photos and they're not going nowhere. Um, if somebody wants you, um, they're going to hire you. Plain and simple. Um, they're going to pay for your photos. So don't be duped. If you want to go out there, you look for legitimate companies, um, you can contact me. I'll be more than happy to help some of y'all out. But um, definitely don't be duped. There's a lot of bad people out there. All right. Now, what about the writers? Now, was this you become a writer because you wanted to be a writer? I mean, you know, when you did the book or it just came to you to write it because you knew you had to write the book? Well, Reggie, God is good. Uh, it, it, it's my story, so that's what made me write it. It's just I felt people needed to hear it. I mean, there's so many inspirational things, blessings every day that happens that people don't realize in their life is actually a blessing or a miracle. And I felt like if this book can touch one person, then I'm doing my job on this earth. Outstanding. So basically, it's probably a lot of people that got stories and they probably came in their head once, you know, every now and again thinking about, man, I wish I could write a book and just tell my life story. But how do I go about doing it? That's the question I want to ask you. What do they do if they was in that situation? Well, you put it down. I mean, nowadays with the internet and everything, you can you can self-author, you can self-publish. I mean, you write it down, you have somebody cross-check your facts and do everything and publish it yourself if you have to. But if you really want to get it out there, you can get it out there. I mean, there's 50 million book co publishing companies that they can contact. Once you write it down, and if you're not good at writing, you can um, now those little text to speak, speak it out, talk it out, get it on paper and let somebody go through and help you do what you got to do. And the last thing is your traveling business. First of all, tell me how do people become a travel agent if they want to do that. And then I want to tell me how you can book stuff up if people want to, you know, if they want to book you, if they want to do things and they want you to book it for them, how to get in touch with you as well. Okay, so if they want to book me, once again, they can go to Native Diva dot online. They can book me that way as well. Um, my number's there. They can call me. And book through me directly um but if they want to be a travel agent and actually i'm going to be hiring this summer so you guys keep keep look you know keep looking out put me on your instagram or whatever i'm going to be hiring some independent work at home travel agents um but yeah all they need to do is study you know you do have to have depending on what state you live in you need to sail they have to have the right to sail to travel mm -hmm. so they might have to get their little you know their little license for that but other than that just find a 
company that they can work with to show them the ropes and they can do it. It's not hard. If you're an outgoing person and you can sell anything or you think you can sell it, why not try? That's what I'm talking about. Well, Miss uh, Native Diva, I appreciate you being on my radio show. It was wonderful to have you. Like I say, it's been a couple of years. I know, I know. But, but Reggie, I'm single, so, you know, I'm left right now. <laughs> okay, then. All right, sister. I see. <laughs> But uh, it's been a while, but God is good, and here I am. That's right. That's right. Now, you got any shout-outs you want to give to anybody? No, nah, just to all y'all, stay blessed. Um, keep your head up. Whatever you want to do, you can do it. Reach out, NativeDiva.com. And the last question I want to ask you, Miss Native Diva, could you please, I mean, could you please tell the world what's the baddest station in the land and the station that pays? The MC Reggie Fresh Morning Show. And there you have it, folks. Miss Native Diva right here on the MC Reggie Fresh Morning Show. Smile like you know what's on my mind So it ain't no need in lying